Welcome to the Certified Professional in Healthcare Quality Exam Prep video. In this video, we will explore project management processes in healthcare. Project Management Processes in Healthcare Project management in healthcare involves planning, executing, monitoring, controlling, and closing projects related to health services, technology implementations, facility upgrades, or new program developments. Effective project management ensures that healthcare projects meet their objectives efficiently and deliver value to patients and stakeholders. Key Phases of Project Management in Healthcare 1. Initiation Defining the project, identifying the need, scope, and objectives of the project. This often involves engaging stakeholders to understand their requirements and expectations. Feasibility Study Assessing the viability of the project in terms of financial, technical, and operational aspects. This includes identifying potential risks and benefits. 2. Planning Developing a project plan, creating a comprehensive plan that outlines the tasks, schedules, resources, budget, and performance targets. The plan should also include risk management strategies and contingency plans. Resource allocation determining the personnel, equipment, and financial resources required and planning their allocation throughout the project. Setting milestones, establishing key milestones to measure progress and align project objectives with expected outcomes. 3. Execution Implementing the plan, mobilizing resources and directing efforts to execute the project according to the plan. This includes managing teams, coordinating tasks, and ensuring that activities align with project goals. Communication management, keeping all stakeholders informed and engaged through regular updates and meetings. Effective communication is crucial for managing expectations and fostering collaboration. 4. Monitoring and control. Tracking progress, using performance metrics, regular status reports, and project management tools, like Gantt charts or project management software to monitor the progress against the plan. Quality control, implementing quality management processes to ensure that the project outputs meet the required standards and are delivered effectively. Adjustments and revisions, making necessary adjustments to the project plan based on performance data and stakeholder feedback to keep the project on track and within budget. 5. Closure Evaluating success, assessing the project's success based on its objectives and the satisfaction of stakeholders. This includes evaluating what went well and what didn't, to identify lessons learned. Documentation, compiling and finalizing all project documents for archival and future reference. This documentation serves as a valuable resource for future projects. Project handover. Transferring the control of any deliverables to the relevant stakeholders or operational teams, ensuring they are equipped to manage and maintain the project outcomes. Tools and techniques used in healthcare project management. Gantt charts, visual tools used to plan and schedule tasks over the project timeline. Critical path method, CPM, a technique to identify tasks that are critical for timely project completion. Project management software. Tools like Microsoft Project, Asana, or Trello that help in planning, scheduling, resource allocation, and communication. Risk management frameworks, systems to identify, analyze, and mitigate potential risks that could impact the project's success. Challenges in healthcare project management Regulatory compliance, navigating complex healthcare regulations that can affect project scope, resources, and timelines. Stakeholder management, managing diverse groups of stakeholders, including clinicians, administrators, patients, and regulatory bodies. Resource constraints, dealing with limited budgets and human resources, which are common in the healthcare sector. Conclusion Effective project management in healthcare not only ensures that projects are completed on time and within budget, but also enhances the quality of care by systematically managing changes and innovations. It is a critical skill for healthcare administrators and leaders aiming to improve service delivery and patient outcomes. If you found this video informative, please like, share, and subscribe.